working on a chicken coop. We just got uh, permission to get chick have chickens. So these are all scrap pieces of wood, except for this is a half a sheet of wood we actually purchased because we needed to have your floorboard. Mm -hmm. Um, everything else in these piles is scraps either from the previous rabbit hutch I had built and then took apart because we don't have rabbits anymore. Mm -hmm. And or um, there's a close by place where they build sheds and I collected the scrap lumber from there. Yeah, so if you're willing to look around a little bit, sometimes you can get the right. wood for nothing. Yep, so. and even the, the hinges and screws and stuff I'm using are all off of the previous hutch. Yeah. Um, so I've got a few new ones if I need it, but I'm going to use all of my pre-used stuff first if I can help it. Yeah. So we're doing this just because with everything that's going on, you know, hopefully not, but they've talked about maybe some shortages like with protein and mm -hmm. eggs. So, you know, we're, we're going to have, uh, I think six laying hens, hopefully. And you know, that, that can feed you, that can give you a lot of protein. Yeah. So that's... Well, and I researched Hutch's online because i we built one before but it's been a while so i found a, a plan for one and there's pictures for it and even that's what the finished product is supposed to look like and this is like the back side of the plan but i'm shortening it by a couple of feet yeah um, which shouldn't matter too much because it, it'll still have uh, the ability for six chickens you can you have to have at least one laying box per two chickens. So it's got lay box, laying box, three laying boxes in it. Mm -hmm. And you want to check with what your six. local rules are. Everyone's got a different situation. So those of you that live out on farms, it's not going to be a problem. But for those of us that live in in an, a residential area, you just have to go through your local local city government, and mm -hmm. and then uh, if you go through the process, they're they're pretty good about it. They just said, yeah, that makes sense. So yeah, and you just <clears> want to check you know how we can only have a max of six yeah um so the the chicken house i looked for square footage wise was fit for six yeah every every the, situation is going to be different right yeah so then over here you can see we've started making the actual run we will have um, wire over the top and on the ground too because we have raccoons here uh, i may even put hot wire around it but then at night uh what my wife and i are building is this coop where they can actually be yeah it'll be locked up where this opening is and on the door on both sides and, the yeah the hutch into the coop. and then the, the raccoons can't box. get into it basically yeah. so this is uh this is kind of a neat way to add to your protein um you know uh for one it's just kind of fun uh but two with the world the way it is right now uh it's not a bad idea to add some protein to your gardening efforts so Take care. Hope you liked the video. Bye.